To keep your inbound marketing strategy running, you need new users constantly discovering your website so you can offer them value in the form of attractive and useful content. The best way to get your website in front of thousands of people is mastering your SEO skills. SEO or search engine optimization is a discipline which involves applying a series of techniques on a website in order to improve its position in search engines. As you'll see in this video, it's very useful within an inbound marketing strategy. Hi, my name is Shannon, and here on Inbound Explained by CyberClick, we cover everything inbound marketing related, from tips and tricks to explainer videos like this one. If you haven't done it already, click on the subscribe button and you won't miss any of our videos. Let's get started. The goal of SEO is to make a website appear as high as possible in the search results in order to attract more visitors and increase the conversion possibilities. To avoid confusion, it is important to distinguish between SEO and SEM. SEO positions the website among organic results, which means we cannot pay the search engine to improve our positioning. In contrast, SEM positions the web through paid ads and search engines. Although there are many search engines worldwide, Google is king. So when we talk about SEO, we're generally referring to positioning a website on Google. Within an inbound strategy, SEO techniques help us create a qualified long-term traffic channel. Once these users have reached our website, we can use different strategies to capture them as leads and help them become potential customers. Advantages of SEO for brands. If your website is your store, SEO is the equivalent of bidding on a showcase and the results are your visits. For example, if you manage to position your website in the first place for a keyword with 100,000 searches per month and the first results take 20% of the clicks, you will likely have 20,000 more monthly visits. Through SEO techniques, we attract visitors to our websites, so it's a very interesting tool to start our inbound marketing process and turn these visitors into leads and eventually customers. Optimizing a website for search engines requires time and effort, but let's keep in mind that it is a long-term strategy. But once you have managed to position the website, you will have a constant source of visits without additional costs. The web positioning techniques are designed to improve the user experience and the quality of the content. If you apply them correctly, not only will you be able to position higher in the search results, but you can also improve the results of your website in general. Users rely on Google algorithms to distinguish which pages are of the highest quality and contain the information they seek. Therefore, if your website appears among the first results, users will tend to trust your brand more and you'll have an easier time converting them. Types of SEO. There are two fundamental distinctions we have to make to differentiate the types of SEO. On one hand, we have off-page SEO versus on-page SEO. And on the other hand, we have white hat SEO and black hat SEO. Let's go through both of them. First, on-page SEO versus off-page SEO. On-page SEO, as its name suggests, is the one that focuses on improving the website itself through the optimization of your website's internal elements. This includes your content, titles, descriptions, loading times, etc. For the search engines, on-page SEO improves the relevance of your website, that is, its correspondence with a specific search or searches. It can also attract users thanks to the content that is displayed on the Google results page. In addition, by improving the structure of the website and its content, on-page SEO can improve the user experience. Off-page SEO focuses on external factors and aims to determine the authority or popularity of a website. Within the elements of off-page SEO, we can find links to a website, presence on social media, mentions in the media, or the ratio of users who click when it appears in the search results. In summary, we can think of off-page SEO as our public relations of the page. White Hat SEO versus Black Hat SEO. White Hat SEO is based on techniques that comply with the guidelines of search engines and that aim to position the website in an ethical manner. In general, White Hat techniques result in higher quality websites and improve the user experience. In contrast, Black Hat SEO seeks to bypass the rules to achieve rapid results in a short amount of time. For example, including hidden content on the website or spamming links and forums and blogs. Although sometimes you can get a quick jump in positioning, in the long term it's very risky and doesn't really add value to the brand or the user, so we don't recommend using it. And you may be asking, what are some basic SEO techniques you can start applying after watching this video? Well, we've got you covered. Here are some of the basic tools that will improve your web positioning within an inbound marketing strategy. 
Selection of keywords. Keywords are concepts or topics that we position our content around. Therefore, a good SEO strategy is based on studying which topics are the most searched within our field and how to include them in our website so Google can detect them. Web optimization. Websites that break down often, are poorly optimized for mobile devices, and have an excessive loading time can be SEO's biggest enemy. To be able to position correctly in search engines, it's necessary to take the technical steps to fine tune your website and its content. Choosing friendly URLs. The URLs or links to different pages within a website are a key aspect of positioning. Ideally, they should be as simple as possible and contain the keywords that we want to position for. Creating quality content. Search engines like pages that are useful to users. Having well-organized and up-to-date quality improves your content and will improve your SEO. Titles, headings, and descriptions. All articles and pages within the website must have a descriptive title containing the keywords. They should also be divided into different sections within the corresponding headings. Additionally, the descriptions of each page appears in the results of the search engine, so optimizing them should be a priority. Link building. This refers to including techniques designed to generate inbound links in our web page from other sites. We'll always seek to get links from quality sites, avoid spam, and take care of the details like the text of the link and the type of relationship that it establishes with our page. We hope this video helps you learn a little bit more about what SEO is and how it can improve your search engine positioning to reinforce your inbound marketing strategy and the results of your brand in the medium and long term. If you want to master your SEO skills, check out CyberClick's free ebook in the description down below. We deep dive into 10 different strategies you can use to optimize your website and content. We cover everything you need to know, including the different types of SEO, how Google determines what to rank, how to structure your content, how to properly use keywords, and much more. And if you want to keep learning about digital and inbound marketing, make sure to subscribe to Inbound Explain. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next video.